What's going on guys? So in a previous video I told you guys that I wanted to keep you up to date with everything that was happening with DC Universe which is DC Comics streaming service and today or I should say yesterday news dropped that we are getting a new show on the streaming service called Doom Patrol. This is on top of the other shows that have already been announced which is the live action Titan series, the live action Swamp Thing and the animated Young Justice Outsiders and Harley Quinn. So it looks like DC is going all out with bringing a whole bunch of new shows to this DC streaming service so new subscribers all subscribers really will have plenty of content to watch once this thing goes live. Now the interesting thing about Doom Patrol is there was a photo that came out earlier in the year of one of the Titan scripts because that show is already in production and the title of the episode was called Doom Patrol. So it looks like we're actually going to get we're going to get a sneak peek of the Doom Patrol people or characters I should say and in the Titan show and then they will spin off to their own series which is kind of what we've seen happen in the Arrowverse. You know a lot of like on Arrow Flash showed up there for and he spun off to have his own show. So it seems like they're kind of keeping that same kind of formula for this DC universe. Before we talk about the characters that are going to be in the show, let's go ahead and talk about the info regarding this. Doom Patrol is going to be a one hour live action drama. It will begin production later this year for a 2019 debut. The series is going to have a 13 episode season, which I'm totally for because I, I actually prefer when all of the episodes just have meaning and there's not really filler. So it's gonna be kind of cool that we're only gonna get 13 episodes episodes. Hopefully all those 13 episodes are going to be just like jam-packed awesomeness. It's being written by Greg Berlanti, Jeff Johns, and Jeremy Carbon, which uh, you've definitely heard some of those names before. If Greg Berlanti seems, you know, like familiar to you, he's basically has his hands in all of the Arrowverse stuff. So if you enjoy those shows, I, I can't say if these shows are going to be exactly like that. It does seem like the costumes do look better on this show. So I'm not too sure like what we're going to get exactly. But if you are a fan of Berlanti stuff, You've seen it on the Arrowverse. It seems like you're going to get some of that here in this series as well. There is no confirmation that these universes are connected to the Arrowverse, but it does seem like the shows that are going to be on the DC Universe streaming service are going to be connected since Doom Patrol will be a part of Titan. This is the logline for Doom Patrol. Doom Patrol is a reimagining of one of DC's most beloved groups of outcast superheroes. Robot Man, Negative Man, Elastigirl, and Crazy Jane, led by a modern day mad scientist, Dr. Niles Calder, AKA The Chief. The Doom Patrol's members each suffer horrible accidents that gave them superhuman abilities, but have left them scarred and disfigured. Traumatized and downtrodden, the team found purpose through The Chief, who brought them together to investigate the weirdest phenomenon in existence and to protect Earth from what they find. Part support group, part superhero team, the Doom Patrol is a band of super-powered freaks who fight for a world that wants nothing to do with them. Picking up after the events of Titans, Doom Patrol will find these reluctant heroes in a place that they never expected, called to action by none other than Cyborg, who comes to them with a mission hard to refuse, but with a warning that hard to ignore, their lives will never, ever be the same. I just want to point that out that this log line said cyborg which is going to be crazy because are we going to get cyborg and titans or will this be cyborg from maybe a justice league and I don't know about you guys but that gets me really excited about this show and I'm like whoa where is cyborg going to come from because I haven't seen any confirmation of cyborg being in titans but we do know that there are versions of the Teen Titans that had Cyborg a part of the group. So that's pretty awesome that we are possibly going to be getting a Cyborg in this that is going to give admission to the Doom Patrol. And this is pretty awesome. So it looks like we're going to have some kind of storyline here since Doom Patrol is going to be taking place after the events of Titans. So that's going to be kind of cool. So it looks like all of these things are going to intertwine and maybe not all happen at once, which is kind of cool because we've seen it happen where... When you're watching stuff in the Arrowverse, like everything's going on at once and everything's kind of overlapping. But it might be pretty cool to see one series, then the next series comes out and everything that happened in that previous series affects the next series. That might be kind of cool to see. It might be something very different. And I am definitely interested in these new shows that they're going to be launching on this DC streaming service. Now, if you're like me, you're kind of asking, like, who are the Doom Patrol? Because I don't know that much about them. So I wanted to ask you guys, if you want me to do a deep dive on the Doom Patrol to bring you more information, let me know in the comment sections down below. Also, give a like on this video if you want that to happen. But uh, from my own perspective, since I've been reading a lot of DC comics lately, I do know that Doom Patrol was kind of rebooted or reimagined 
recently in the Gerard Way's Young Animals imprint over at DC Comics. So they had some really cool like covers and it looked like they had some really cool artwork going on, but I haven't got to read any of the storylines personally, but I do know that they have recently been in the comic books and it doesn't seem like they're following that one exactly. There are some characters from that one, but there are also some older characters from previous iterations of the Doom Patrol. And uh, I will just say that I was reading a little bit about them before I did this video and some people were saying that Doom Patrol dates pre before X-Men and some people were saying that this could have been the idea where X-Men came from which there's no confirmation of that but just hearing that Doom Patrol is very connected to X-Men or could possibly be in that realm that's pretty awesome to hear like I said no confirmation on that just something I read um but that's kind of cool if this was the the group that inspired the X-Men because you know they're kind of dope too anyways guys that's all I got for this video but remember if you want me to do a deep dive on these characters to find out all the cool stuff about them let me know in the comment sections down below give this video a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe button because well if I do that video you're definitely going to want to watch it right also don't forget to hit notifications because that freaking subscribe button's useless apparently so yeah definitely do that too also check out some of my recent videos and I will keep you guys up to date with any more DC Universe news that comes out especially the moment that price point drops because I know that's what everybody wants to know about but that, that's it guys as always I'm your host Juice Box remember when, when you wake up in the morning ask yourself something if I have a daily dose of juice see you guys next time Beep.